in this short video tutorial we'll understand how to convert a string value into integer using c sharp so if we have a string variable str and we give it let's say a value one two three four five which is actually a number but it has been written as a string because we have added double quotes to this number so we want to convert this string which is a valid integer number in the form of a string into integer so let's say we have an integer variable a so we want to convert the value of this string and put it into this variable now to do this we'll be making use of the convert class which has been given to us by c sharp so if we use the convert class you will find that it contains three methods one is 2 int 16 the second is 2 int 32 and the third is 2 int 64 so we can use any of these methods to convert a string into an integer so if your integer value is small you can use 2 int 16 or if your integer value is a little large you can use 2 int 32 so let's say we use 2 int 32 function and we pass it the string value of this variable so the 2 int 32 function which is present in the convert class will convert the value of this string into integer and give that value to the integer variable a so let's run this program in debug mode and see what results we get So notice that the string value is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and there are double quotes around this value which means it's a string. Now the value of integer a right now is 0. So when we will run this line the value of uh, the string 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 will be converted into integer and saved into the int variable a. So let's execute this line of code and now let's look at the value of a. The value of a is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 in the numeric format whereas the value of str is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 in the string format with double quotes. So with this I hope you have understood how to convert a string uh, value into integer. Before you start using the 2 and 32 function to convert a string into an integer keep in mind that this function will only uh, convert the value of string into integer if the value that you pass to this function is a valid integer number. So if you pass some random string which is not an integer value then this function will throw an exception and will not convert that uh, random value into integers. For example if you pass a hello world string to this function it will not convert the hello world string into integer because hello world is not a valid integer number. So with this, we'll end this short tutorial here. For more free c -sharp learning content, please visit openeschool.com slash learn c -sharp. Also, please subscribe to our channel to get regular updates on the new videos that we add. Thank you.